Hi, my name is Ivan, and I'm building an airplane to break the world speed record. Yeah, I'm finally back. Uh, I survived the end of the year and finished the electric prototype. And in this video, you're gonna see how I'm testing it. If you didn't see my previous videos, go ahead and check them out right now. Okay, so the airplane is mounted by one ball. It's mounted at the place where the center of mass is located. Uh, that way it represents the real flight, because in a real flight, all of the forces acting on the airplane, acting around the center of mass. And so that way the airplane can stabilize it itself. And then when I move elements up, actually in this case down, uh, airplane, they create torque and rotate airplane nose up, but because it's mounted inverted, uh, down. And it creates force. So why I'm testing it on top of the car instead of actually flying it? Actually, I already tested that plane on top of the car before. And you may ask, why am I testing it again? Uh, it's because the first time I was testing just a wooden wing before making the mold to make sure that that wing can produce necessary amount of lift on takeoff speeds. And double check my calculations. This time, the goal of the testings were not to find if it creates enough lift, but to find if elements can produce enough torque to rotate the nose up and create enough lift. Okay, so this is the first run. We're just gonna see if it's not gonna fly off the roof at 40 miles per hour. Yeah, so we just did the test of the lift and torque lift slash torque and the plane creates enough torque with elements to rotate the nose up and create over six kilograms of thrust it was seven kilograms at one point and we were going like 60 or 70 right about 70 we, uh, we were going 70 miles per hour so it's gonna fly hopefully or crash <laughs> okay so this is how it looks from outside Right now the car is going 70 miles per hour and I'm pulling up, pulling up again and this is how it looks. Oh, it's awesome. Don't forget to subscribe to YouTube channel and I have Instagram and Facebook where I post much more recent progress. See you in the next video.